Hello, welcome to How to Do It, part uh, one of Mail Merge. Uh, using Word 2012 for Mac. So, we're going to open a new um, blank document here, and we are going to make sure that we have, in this particular case, uh, Open Day available. So we know what open day is there and that's the data that we're going to put into this document. So we're going to just check that we've got an A4 uh, document and that it is indeed a uh, portrait. Kind of see that anyway. And we're going to type in a little bit of information. Um, so we'll just do that. So I've uh, left some spaces for the data here and I've started typing here. The open days will be held on the... Okay, so we've put that little lot in and the next thing we're going to do is to make sure that we go to Tools and Mail Merge Manager is up. You can't see it because it's over here. So there it is. We're creating a new form letter and we are going to now get a list of the data. Here's the data um, and we're in practice paper 4 and I think I said to you it was open day that I needed. Um, say OK there and again OK. So um, you are asked to put uh, the merge information here at the top and the first thing you want is company name very nice drag it across drop it in so company name uh, actually got name here first my apologies got name company name address one address two um, and okay so I've now put one two three four five six merge fields in and um, we're beginning to get to a position where our template is uh, sort of looking um, not quite ready but it's getting there. So we are, we're asked to justify so we'll do command A because we're in a Mac and we'll go um, to fully justify and we will have bold as that's what we've been asked for and italic any font type we like uh, I'm just going to put this in bigger and I'm going to make it red just for the heck of it so and you have been asked to insert your name and center number so so we've gone up the top and a double click in here look uh, it could equally have been the same if we'd gone down to the bottom if we wanted it in here but we're going to have it at the top uh, 14404 is our centre number any type of font size margins to suit and I'm going to make my margins nice and small there we are so it's all down here um, as we are there and we need to just save this now um, and we've got to save as I'm going to make sure that I know where this is going it should be going into my desktop uh, just I just need to save this as red invites R E D I N V I T I V I T E S red invites I just put do after it so I know it's me and we'll save it. You're asked to then print that off. So we're asked to print it off. If we go to File and uh, Print, you'll see I've got two print options here. I'm printing to the one in the IT room. I want just the one copy. So go Print and away it goes. Printer's working, so that's good news. Okay, so the next bit is to narrow down who you're actually going to send this to and it's down here in options. 
So if we go to options and we're going to look at all those who are in um, Bedfordshire. So we want the county and equals to Bedfordshire. And I'm going to just say OK. Now at this particular point we haven't merged the information so we now need to go down here and just do a preview. Filter for the Bedfordshire, OK, and we should just be able to see one, two, doesn't look like there's very many there. OK, so um, a little delay there, but you can either then merge to printer or merge to new document. So we're just going to merge it to the new document, check that it's there. Um, in this case, there's just two um, in Bedfordshire and um, there they are so we can now print that and uh, we've asked to save it as well so we'll print that both of those let's for argument's sake uh, say that um, you weren't asked to mail merge to Bedfordshire and that you wanted to find out where those in Derbyshire were. So if we did the same here you'll see that hopefully this now picks up Derbyshire, uh, second Derbyshire, so there's three for Derbyshire just as a quick illustration and that's all there is to mail merge. Thanks for watching.